Hi Virgo, welcome to my third channel, my Virgo only channel. My name is Chelsea. I post every day bringing you the latest updated tarot reading and predictions. I also live stream every day on my main channel, Chelsea Love Tarot, giving live personal readings. Link to my main channel is in the description box below. For those of you who like to win a personal reading with me, details in my latest post on the community section. In this reading, we're going to find out who has been missing you lately and why. Today is the 23rd of September 2023. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 8.48 a.m. Okay. Virgo, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me from Virgo. What's been missing Virgo lately and why? Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and this person. Setting is temporary. I'm looking for a new place, like a permanent place, at, le at least for one year here in Malaysia. Now the pentacles in one verse at the bottom of the deck. Okay, Virgo. This person could be a Virgo Capricorn Taurus, but could also be a fire sign. Um, sorry, this is water sign. One second, let me close the window. I think the glare not helping but <laughs> anyway so sorry about that but anyway we've got the nine of cups you remember the nine of cups was the first card that came out right so this person could be a fire sign aries and water sign pisces cancer scorpio so strong water i'm picking up on uh, this person maybe has um earth as well somewhere in the chart could also have some fire aries sagittarius leo now virgo this person definitely misses you right look at the six of cups but for some of you you have a few people missing you okay because these court cards can indicate that like it could mean that these are separate people but could also mean one person embodying all of these court cards so just bear in mind but definitely strong water strong fire strong earth okay six of cups there's a missing card right so one person in particular here has been missing you a lot because both of you had such a good time together six of cups right um this is reminiscing about good times memories that both of you have created with each other but there is some sort of an ending though with the ten of swords okay whether whatever the ending could be okay it could be a breakup or just um brief separation uh could be because of distance connection had to end temporarily because ten of swords is a minor arcana so i feel like most likely for a lot of you maybe this could be a temporary ending okay for some of you maybe there has been a breakup between you and this person or some sort of celebration a very painful ending okay now we've got the queen of wands right here Virgo, this person finds you to be so alluring, so sexy, right, and so confident. This is you, right, next to the Queen of Pentacles. For some reason, I feel like these two queens are you, so you're embodying uh, the Queen of Pentacles and the Queen of Wands. So this person doesn't only find you to be somebody, you know, the typical Virgo who is hardworking or um, loyal, committed, stable got a good head on your shoulders but also somebody somebody insanely attractive okay so this person could be missing just being also i feel like i feel like this is someone you have had you have been intimate with because the queen of wands is a very passionate queen right so it sometimes could indicate you know um sex <laughs> i don't know if i could say that maybe i've already said the word just now but never mind i'm just afraid that i might get like uh flagged for saying certain words but anyway we've got the five of swords right here now 
this person doesn't really want you to know, okay? Because look, five of swords, four of pentacles, somebody who is a little bit closed off, um, because also the king of cups is somebody who doesn't really want to express how he feels. So a very contained energy I'm picking up on, Virgo. This person is has a lot of self-control in terms of, at least in terms of how he or she expresses things to you, right? And then we've got the Empress here in reverse. Hmm. Now, although the Empress is great, of course, Empress sits in the highest position, right? Definitely. But then I feel like two queens, it's like the, these two queens make up and make the make the empress and this is why the empress here is in one verse split into two so i kind of feel like virgo there's something maybe a little bit naughty something naughty that you have done with this person because the the king of wands here is also in one verse there's somebody here i don't know who this one this one is okay it could be one of these people or just one person in particular but i definitely see there's one person here mrs just you being naughty there's something very naughty about you that they miss or something that was very um impromptu that you may have done because the somehow emphasis emphasis is like a very motherly energy but with it being reversed right now this moment it just makes me feel like maybe uh, something that you did that they didn't expect, right? You may have come off as somebody very nurturing, caring, got a good head on your shoulders. And then at one time, one time, you started embodying the Queen of Wands. So this is, I feel like, another side of you, Virgo, that this person could be missing. But the Empress in Rose also can indicate that maybe this is somebody you're not really nurturing right now that you can't nurture this person right now this moment okay i'm gonna pull out more cards here for go let's see more i'm on antibiotics again <laughs> went to see the doctor yesterday apparently the ones that i took in vietnam it wasn't like strong enough but anyway we've got the four of cups here in our first so i feel like this person didn't know or didn't think that he or she would miss you this much but yeah turned out to be that case right four of cups right next to the six of cups and the ace of cups here is in our first maybe this person has cried a little bit feeling sad feeling a little bit like unstable but i don't see them really wanting you to know so they are very very with the king of pentacles this these two combination here um, the King of Cups and the Four of Pentacles, it just makes me feel that Virgo, as maybe this person has cried and felt emotionally uh, vulnerable, but don't really want you to know, yeah? They may also feel a little bit rejected by you, or maybe there's someone whom you may have felt that they may have rejected you, but actually, no, Virgo, I feel like this person just loves, this person has feelings for you, okay? Um, there's really, I, I see... There is no doubt that this person has feelings for you, romantic feelings for you, misses you. But Knight of Pentacles here is in reverse. Maybe for some of you, yeah, this could be someone you're separated from. Um, maybe they couldn't commit. Or it could be for a myriad of reasons. Myriad of reasons because of the Ten of Swords here, right? For some of you, it could be because of distance. For some of you, it could be because of money. Uh, for some of you, it's because of career. And for some of you, perhaps... It could be a third party situation, right? With the Queen of Wands right here. So, don't know, Virgo. I just feel like, yeah, and it could also be multiple people here. Multiple people. There's one person whom you separated from who is in and out of your life. This person misses you. And then you've got one, another person here, perhaps, if there are a few people, yeah? And you've got another person here whom actually catches feelings for you, has caught feelings for you. Uh, you have spent some really good times with this person 
um, this person is quite closed off in terms of expressing to you how they feel. Um, this person misses you as well, okay? Hmm. So there are at least, I would say at, at least two people. Look at the tower, the bottom of the deck. Either this could be somebody feeling like, oh my gosh, I didn't expect, I didn't expect to miss Virgo. I definitely see that. The Four of Cups here and the Six of Cups right here. These two cards makes me feel like this person didn't expect that they would miss you. They would end up missing you. Um, and there's some a, a part of you, Virgo, this side of you, if you're embodying the Queen of Wands, um, there's something very sensual that may have happened between two of you or you, you may have done something a little bit naughty, a little bit out of character that I feel like that could have sparked something in this person's heart makes this person actually falls in love with you so again this person doesn't didn't expect that they would miss you or fall in love with you but there's some sort of an ending between the two of you or like a temporary setback okay it could be because of anything distance again or money career or third party situation it could be any anything and that's definitely again the tower this person may have realized that, but the tower also can indicate you have one more person whom could be missing you right now because both of you are separated. Because there are cards that indicates some sort of separation between the two of you. I'm gonna pull out some of these um, oracles. <laughs> Let's see more Virgo about this person who is missing you. Two people at least, yeah. But at least like, I would say like 70% of you. You have two people missing you. We need to let each other go. So there could have been certain circumstances, something that may have happened. Could be because again, third party, long distance, money, career. Okay, could be any of these things. You're separated from um these these people at least there are two okay i love you what did i tell you virgo you know i rarely i use every time i use this um deck i love you rarely comes out so this is yeah i love you so this person loves you that's why he or she could be missing you right now and you may have two people who are in love with you but you have at least one person here whom it's like hey i can't believe that i've fallen in love with virgo then I hope that you can forgive me one day and you do have someone who misses you, who has somewhat betrayed you, okay, in the past, for sure. Because Five of Swords, deception, a little bit of a deceptive energy, Ten of Swords, the betrayal energy, and then we've got the King of Wands in my first, which is also like somebody who can't quite be trusted, okay. You came closer than anyone. Could be somebody where both of you could have talked about the future, you know, plan something for the future, could have been in a serious relationship or almost have gotten into a serious serious relationship. Yeah, you've got somebody who has messed up here. I know I messed up everything. Yeah, definitely separated from this person. This person misses you. I bury myself in work to forget you. Yeah, this could either be someone who is um, either somebody very hardworking or somebody who works um, a lot just to forget about you, okay? I'm going to pull out some of these romance angels right here, Virgo. Let's see. Virgo. Let's see more. But for some reason, Virgo, I feel like this person could be planning something, right? Five of Swords. This person who misses you could be planning something. It could be either one of them or both of them. Because Virgo, right here is the Queen of Pentacles, you're in an upright position. So I feel like this person definitely sees your worth and your value, misses you, misses something that was out of character of you. Um, also, Virgo, it could be because you've been acting a little bit out of character lately. If you're still currently talking to this person, okay, there's something that I, I feel that was really unexpected that this person, again, may have 
fall in love with you because of that or started to miss you because I still feel like for whether something that you did that was really sensual or naughty that this person could have ended up thinking you're kind of different and this is why the tower the tower was in an upright position right here at the bottom of the deck right here okay but anyway could I see a little bit more new love didn't I tell you you at least have one new person who is missing you who has caught feelings for you who loves you okay and then you've got the express your love so this person has problem expressing to you how he feels about you, okay? This person misses you. See, you have three love cards already. I love you, express your love, new love. So I'm sensing it's someone new. For those of you, if you're currently connected to someone new. But if not, this could be someone whom has... See, I do see another person here, okay? Someone who has messed things up. Someone who has uh, betrayed you. Someone you thought you could that you could have been with for a long time but it just didn't happen okay maybe the way things ended was very abrupt or very dramatic very soon you've got another card that says true love right here Virgo you have someone who loves you or has caught feelings for you for sure this person misses you okay religious factors so someone who's very different than you are perhaps could be religion spirituality or skin color ethnicity um citizenship <laughs> okay or just very different people from each other age gap could mean that as well this could be the one Virgo, you have someone someone new for if okay Virgo, if you don't have anybody right now maybe this could also be a prediction of somebody who is coming in very soon that this could be your true love and this could be the one for you but Virgo, we're asking the question right who who has been missing who has been missing you lately i definitely see there are two people okay if you don't have somebody new it's someone from your past you have if it's someone from your past, this person still loves you and this person still sees you as you are the one for them, um, still sees you as their true love um, and could be planning to express their love for you. And also, this new love here, Candy K. Virgo, maybe this person wants to know if you have somebody new in your life, right? The five of swords, or if you already have someone new in your life, they could be missing you and also thinking hey you know maybe then they've messed up right i know i messed up every I, I know i messed up everything they've messed up and perhaps it's too late and maybe that's why the tower is right here forgiving and learning so yeah you do at least have an ex someone from your past who misses you and this is someone perhaps whom you had to try to forgive yourself or forgive this person and learn and learn from like had and also had to learn a very big lesson because of the way things ended between the two of you but Virgo if you are currently connected to someone this new love person definitely misses you okay but maybe you know I was talking about that brief separation for somebody it could be a brief separation where hey, you're going to work, or this person is going to work, or you can't see each other today, right? Just basically being physically apart. Um, doesn't have to be, doesn't have to be, it could be long distance, or it could be separation, but I feel like for some of you, it could just be this person misses you even though, even though if they haven't seen you in an hour, even though if you, both of you are living in the same house, but you're in a bathroom, right? <laughs> I'm so dramatic. But anyway, Virgo, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to my all of my other channels. Links are all in the description box below. And um, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button so you'll be notified. Every time when I post your videos, take care, Virgo. Love you. Bye.